Hello, this is uh, Mike Lunn. I'm the North American Product Manager for Cooper Controls. I'm very excited to introduce to you today the newest addition to our Gringate brand, which is the Room Controller product line. So the Room Controller is the first room-based solution that guarantees design simplification, ensures code compliance, and provides a program-free installation in a single box. The Room Controller is uh, this product right here, which is actually allows all installation uh, and a single plane. The line voltage is readily accessible to the installing contractor, providing separation of both normal and emergency sections, as well as separation to our low voltage compartment with uh, simple quick connect connectors uh, for all low voltage devices. This uh, minimizes installation and setup time where our room controller automatically recognizes when the smart devices are connected to the unit and decides how those devices should work together. The ensures code compliance items such as UL 924, occupancy, the new ASHRAE receptacle codes that are required out of ASHRAE 90.1-2010 as well as things that are required in California Title 24, such as demand response, which is required now in all locations uh, over 10,000 square feet. The room controller also guarantees design in, uh, integrity 100% of the time by allowing those smart devices, once they're connected, to perform always the same way as they were originally specified by the uh, electri electrical engineer. Look at the room controller product. We have quick connect uh, connections over here for all low voltage devices, including a unique slide station that is very intuitive for the end user to use, as well as all of our wall stations that are predefined and pre-engraved specific for the end user. We know how the end user interacts with their space. If you walk into an office building, you may want to have a half lights or full lights and a raise lower button. The room controller product ships that way, knowing how the end user is going to work with the lighting in their space. If we had a classroom type solution, we, we understand that there's an entry station where you're going to have the lighting turned on uh, initially when you walk into the room. And then you may have a teacher station where the teacher will want to adjust the lighting for the environment to enhance the learning. Uh, we uh, provide all of those stations with engraving based on that. If the engraving does not quite uh, fit your specific environment, that engraving can be customized as well as the functionality of the buttons can be adjusted uh, using our predefined buttons that we had already defined. Other items as part of the room controller are our new daylight sensor, which we have developed in coordination with the room controller product. This is a, a very unique daylight sensor that we designed for both ceiling and fixture mount installations, as well as including a full 340 degree uh, swivel head that allows it to adjust based on the space constraints that you may have to install it in. With the daylight sensor, is a uh, simple to use adjustable uh, programming tool. So by default, as soon as you connect the daylight sensor, it will automatically uh, begin three levels of daylight dimming, uh, which is uh, unheard of in our industry right now. Uh, if those, those levels do not meet your specific uh, space requirements, we developed a handheld remote that will allow you to adjust them very easily. It includes an ID button so you can determine what uh, particular uh, light level range the daylight sensor is set to today uh, with LED feedback letting you know uh, by, based on either two, three, or four blinks. By looking at the remote, you'll see the matching two, three, and four blinks on here, as well as a definition of a low light level, a high light level, or a direct sun light level. We chose to go that route where we actually use terms such as low, high, and direct sun. Uh, not many end users uh, are fully uh, aware of lux or foot candles, so we decided to uh, go a very simplified approach uh, to make sure that everyone understands how to use this. If I want to change the range, I simply press the button uh, and the daylight sensor will blink the, the appropriate uh, amount of times. That sets your range uh, for your placement of your sensor. If I want to adjust a specific daylighting zone, we have three zones right here with a raise and lower button for each zone. All I have to do is hit the up or down button to adjust how the daylighting will react in that particular zone. Very easy to use. Uh, very easy to commission. Next on our line is our occupancy sensor. 
So uh, the room controller actually will connect to all occupancy sensors that are part of the Green Gate family. Uh, we don't have any specific uh, aux sensors that you have to use with the room controller. Uh, we actually have a, uh, a, a something called an occupancy sensor coupler uh, that the Green Gate sensor connects to and makes it a uh, quick connect uh, connection. That allows us to use our new ceiling sensors, uh, 2,000 square feet, 1,000 square feet, 500 square feet, dual tech, passive infrared, and ultrasonic, however we want to do it. We can also very easily switch to our wall corner sensors if there's a suspended lighting such as core light or near-ray that are in the space. As we move into our next uh, uh, section, uh, we have our receptacle control. So receptacle control is required by ASHRAE 90.1 2010. Uh, it's also going to be required in future energy codes in other, in other states. Uh, every uh, receptacle, every six, every six feet, 50% of those receptacles have to be switched based on the occupancy in the space. Uh, this device actually allows that. It's a full 20 amp rated, and it automatically tracks with the occupancy in the room. The receptacle turns on when somebody pushes the button, uh, and it only turns off when the space is vacant. So. This is actually a required feature uh, for all new construction coming up later in the year. Other items that we have uh, as part of the uh, package is uh, alternate voltage switch pack uh, connection, uh, which uh, allows you to uh, have the room controller control both 120 and 277 volt circuits. Uh, that's simply done by using our, uh, our, our, uh, our BMS output uh, to control a switch pack, that is a dual voltage switch pack uh, for the what it, whichever alternate voltage it may happen to be. We use that same BMS output uh, for egress lighting, so I can uh, control uh, maintain uh, corridor lighting in the on position if anyone is in the uh, a office uh, in the in the uh, in the office building. Other uh, features that the room controller has is it automatically has a uh, it has a patent pending feature. Uh, which allows us to uh, control solar tubes. So if you're in a classroom environment, you may want to uh, show a presentation. When you hit the AV button on the wall station, not only does it dim the lighting for the uh, classroom, but it also will close the solar tubes. When your presentation is finished, you press the AV button again, the solar tubes will open, and the room controller automatically goes back to daylight dimming. One of the new features that we've come out with uh, for, a, uh, for the room controller is uh, uh, two new wall stations that we created for our conference rooms. These include a scene selection station, which allows you to uh, have presets uh, for your conference room to automatically adjust multiple lights with a single button press, as well as individual button control station or individual dimmer control station. And that also allows you to control the dimmers individually. So you can choose a scene, and then you can manually adjust them very easily uh, from the same two gang station. Uh, this actually makes a conference room very easily done with the room controller. Additional versions of the room controller, there are actually five models. There's a switching version only. There's a dimming version with three dimmers. There's a dimming version with two dimmers. There's a dimming version with a UL924 emergency relay, and then there's a, a healthcare version. We're actually showing that over in our fail-safe uh, booth uh, today, uh, and that allows pillow speaker control from the patient bed to control the lighting. Again, this is a unique feature that only Cooper has, working with some of our business partners, uh, to uh, provide that pillow speaker that gives us three daylight, uh, three dimming zones. Uh, uh, manually from the patient bed that also track with the wall stations that are in the room. So I can talk a little bit about our emergency relay uh, functionality. Again, this is another patent pending uh, a solution that's part of the room controller. Uh, there's a three amp relay in there that automatically will track uh, with uh, relay one. It uh, turns on and off based on relay one control. However, if the room controller loses normal power, uh, that relay will turn on automatically and it will be fed from the emergency generator uh, and a UL1008 switch. It also has a integral test feature. So every 30 days, the facility manager is supposed to go around and test those UL924 devices. Often this requires getting a ladder, going around and, and popping ceiling tiles and pushing a button, or maybe going to an electrical closet and throwing a key switch and then going and checking the lighting of the space. 
what we've chosen again to keep things simple and keep things fast and um, and uh, easy for the end user to do is if you walk into the a space with a room controller you can press any off button four times and it will turn off the normal lighting and it will turn on the emergency lighting and validate that that relay is working and that the emergency power is going fe getting fed through that relay so no ladders involved, no popping ceiling tiles, and no walking from an electrical closet to test your emergency lighting. So all these things together did what we're trying to do, which is reduce our installation time, maximize your lighting and receptacle load energy savings, simplify complex designs with, uh, with our room controller solutions in our prepackaged quick kits that we have. So the final piece of the room controller solution is not only do we have all these energy uh, code compliant uh, uh, solutions, we actually provide it in a single box. So rather than having the electrical contractor opening several boxes to set up a single room, we have one box that ships to the site when they, and it's shipped to the site, whether it's an office or a classroom, with the, uh, the uh, specific installation instructions for that type of space to make it easy for the installing contractor again. As soon as they pop the lid, there's a wiring diagram right there on the inside cover showing how everything is wired together, showing how the uh, room is, typical layout would be, uh, as well as having nice easy access to all the components that they can install. So this makes, minimizes our installation and setup time with smart devices that perform immediately uh, without any programming or engraving. So it ensures code compliance to the strictest energy codes with our integral UL 924 receptacle control and demand response solutions. And it guarantees design integrity 100% of the time with our prepackaged solutions and our program-free click-and-go uh, systems. <laughs>